Welcome back to Quarter Hour Gamers, picking up right where we left off, Manspread and Jamal. Man <laughs> the adventures Jamal. of Manspread and Jamal. <laughs> oh my god, that's so fucked up. I'm going to hell. That's okay, because it's funny. Uh, but we were talking about the limits of comedy. Now, what you said that your limitations is as long as it's not made to intentionally hurt somebody. Yes. If now, you, couldn't... If you're intentionally trying to harm someone, then maybe it's off limits. What do you mean, maybe? Do tell. I, I mean, it, it, it depends. I mean, look, we live in a world where... Shit, no, 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 no! We live in a world where... Where we die over and over again. ...has the right to be offended by whatever they want to be offended by. Right. So, you can never... I don't think you can ever gauge it based off of what offends people. Right. I think intent matters. So, if your intention is to offend, then maybe it should be second-guessed. But if not, then it's fair game. So, and... In a nutshell, basically, comedy is about intent. Yeah, absolutely. I think it's I think it's about intent. Absolutely. And at what point do you think comedians like where the intent is wrong for a comedian? Like people are getting up in arms and stuff like that. Um, uh, to be quite honest with you, my answer stays the same. If they're uh, if they're uh, trying to to hurt someone, I I don't mean making fun of someone because making right. I shouldn't say someone making fun of something. And trying to hurt someone are two different things. In my opinion, at least. All right, you see how I'm jumping on these? Shit! Not like that, though. Don't do what I just did. You die. Go to the right. Go to the right. Quick, 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 quick. There you go. Oh, you can jump on those bubbles. Or not. Ta-da! Okay, so. The hero is back. Manspread never left the building. Ooh, what's up here, though? Uh, when you say the hero is back, you, you mean Jamal? No, I mean Manspread. But... Look at that. See the way I just propelled you up there like yeah, that? Right. That's what You're Jamal does. Welcome. Jamal is an excellent sidekick. Yes, he is. All right. So I'm going to jump on his dude's head. You just wreck. You are the wrecker of a shit shoveling. Or not. That works. Pardon me, Jamal. Wow. Look at all that money. That's mine. Thanks, Jamal. You're the best. Thanks, Jamal. You're the best. Why am I the best? Because I got all that treasure. You didn't get shit. Yeah. Well, I was too busy putting the team on my back. But you can't carry in it. You ain't got no legs, Lieutenant Dan. Lieutenant Dan. You know, I actually had a boss named Dan once, and he had a dual knee replacement surgery. And I had waited for years to, to say that. To what, give to, him the you got new legs? Yeah. You, no, no, no. No, what it was, he finally was like, he was like, I got to take it easy on my legs because he had both knees replaced. I, said, I finally said, I was like, but you ain't got no legs, Lieutenant <laughs> Dan. And that guy gave me such Lieutenant a disappointed Dan. look, and it was Dan. worth the price of admission. God, you know, that movie bothers me. Why does that movie bother you? Get on the get on the platform. Why does Forrest Gump bother me? Yeah, Forrest Gump is like one of the greatest. No, dude, <laughs> you asshole. Bye, man spread, man spread of Jamal. <laughs> You're supposed to destroy those platforms, by the way, to keep uh, going. Yeah, We've yeah. been on this one fucking level for like three episodes now. Fuck! God damn it! Man, spread it, Jamal! <laughs> this bullshit! Hey, don't worry. I'll carry us through this level. You can fucking get yourself killed and I'm gonna laugh. <laughs> What'd I just say? What did I just say? Oh, man. Jamal is the sidekick! Yeah, but let me ask you, though. So, do you... First of all, I think that... I think that that, um, that movie itself kind of speaks a little towards... This might sound crazy. But I think there's like a sexist element involved in this. I feel like if someone were to make a movie about a man. Stop. Stop for a second. Do you not have control over your character anymore? Yeah, I absolutely do. Okay, something weird was going on. Okay. Like the signal was mixed up. It was weird. All right, you're saying? Sorry. So, uh, no, I was just saying, like, I think if someone made a movie about a man with HIV taking advantage of a female who was mentally challenged and getting her pregnant and having a baby, it would be a really terrible, terrible thing. And I feel like there would have been an outrage. Oh, I see what you mean. So you're talking about like, like bass awkward standards. Yes. Gotcha. Okay. See, I never thought about it that way. That's an interesting way to look at it. 
So I, I just think that there's like, I just think there's something really weird as well about making, I mean, and this is going to sound bad because it was a fantastic movie. It's one of the right. greatest movies ever made. Right. But there's something weird about romanticizing a, a woman again with, with HIV having sex with a man who is clearly mentally challenged. Right. And then him being stuck to raise a child by himself. You know what I mean? Right. But if that, but you're saying though, if that was a, if that happened to I a man, I feel like if it was, yeah, if it was in reverse, people there might have been a little bit of an outrage there. Gotcha. Okay, I see what you mean. That makes sense. I never thought about it that way. Of course, then again, I don't think a lot about a lot of things that way at all. I just thought about it as fourth gun up. Plus, I mean, they let him keep custody of his kid when he was clearly a little slow. Right, but he also had the means to take care of the child, though. Was Dude was still, like a multi-millionaire. He was a little slow. But he was a multi-millionaire. Okay, you can come back in well, now. Well, my man Sam from I Am Sam made a mean cup of coffee. Right. They didn't let him keep... I thought they did. I'm pretty sure he lost custody. Treasure Knight, here you go. This is yours. All yours, bro. Let's practice on your voiceovers. You ready for this? Yeah. Hurry up. My gems, my vessel, my ocean. You very, your very presence tarnishes. How was that? <laughs> it was good at first, but then you dropped off there. All right. You are like claim to the <laughs> sea deep, itself. Deep, deep, deep. That's all, Your greed knows no bounds, treasure knight. Your hands are no less dirty. Even now, others are paying for your avarice. 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 That's not a word. Yes, bro. it is. Avarice is another word for greed, bro. Who uses this? This I, let us do well. Winer take all. Oh, uh, why is it all your characters can't read? Like, is uh, what kind of stereotype are you feeding into, you dick? No, really, okay, really. All right, you get left, I get right. Avarice is a word. Shit. Yes, avarice is a word. <laughs> you never heard the song "Avarice" by uh, Ad Disturbed? So, ad ad advitress. Don't do not bubble. Do not butt jump those uh, shovel jump those uh, balls. Oh no, I'm just shovel jumping his balls. All right, here we go. Nope. Oh, shit. Watch out for the hook line and sinker anchor. Hook line anchor. Fuck me. Okay. Uh, no thank you. Well, he did with his anchor. No lube. I mean, we don't need it. We're underwater, really. Can you imagine that? You getting hit with that inappropriately, and you're in salt water. Oh man. oh man, that dude, dude wrecked our shit, dude. I was, I almost killed him. He magically whooped our asses. I almost killed him. You almost had him. I almost had him. I don't think so. He had a lot of health left. I almost had him. All right, lefty righty. Remember, <laughs> look at him go. Oh god, he's got full silver health too. That makes him a big old pain in the butt. I said what what in the butt. I you would, what, you what, would, what, you what, would, what, you would get excited about. Butt. Anchors butt, away. You would love butt. him to anchor oh, your way, wouldn't you? I wouldn't mind, actually. Yeah, <laughs> sure you would. Uh, Pardon me. I wouldn't mind. God, what? Like, you're right. You weren't kidding. All these guys skip leg day. Look at that. They got these big ass bodies, but itty bitty legs, tiny little chicken legs. Cause somebody likes him some chicken. Wait, that was that came out wrong. That, was, that, was, yeah, that, that was, came out bad. I do apologize. That was but terrible. how was that terrible though? It's terrible. Chicken legs. That, that made me think of he like who doesn't like chicken though? Chicken's amazing. I love chicken. Chick fil A is great. Even uh, on Sunday when they're closed. Chick fil A is overrated. How is it overrated? I them's fighting words. Chick fil A is overrated. Chick fil A is amazeballs. balls. It's overrated. Your face is overrated. Said no one ever. Okay. I was about to pick Oh god, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I died. Good thing you came back when you did. You like that? Yeah, because I died. I like a that. I That's went down perfect. like a bitch. Oh. <laughs> you just kind of went down. Jamal went down. Jamal and man spread back on a weird adventure. Jamal and man spread. Hopefully not talking about butt stuff. Yeah, I don't know why we keep bringing up butt stuff. This is weird. Because it's easy. I realize butt jokes, butt and dick jokes are like the easiest thing on the planet to make. So. But uh, the but, thing, like. But your dick makes a joke of itself. I know. I can't help it. It, it tries. Wait, I just realized this guy, he's, he's, he's got bubbles. Yeah. Bubbles, bubbles, yay, I love bubbles. Fuck! Hi, rude. My blanket, my blanket. What? Uh, Michael Jackson named his kid Blanket. I remember that, but my I don't remember him ever saying, My blanket, my blanket. I'm oh, pretty no. sure that was from uh, <laughs> South Park. Oh, I never watched that episode. I actually haven't watched South Park well, since eighth grade, like really sat and watched it. I never really watched South Park. 
Like when we were in middle school, it was like the last time I really sat down and watched all the episodes. Like that's how long ago it's been. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. We're doing good. We almost got him. We almost got him, dude. We almost got him. Oh no, no. Should no. I come back? Uh yeah, I don't have enough health for you too. Oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Ah oh, shit. My blanket, my blanket. We never did get the health pots either. That makes it really difficult. I got faith in you, bro. Uh, your faith's about I to be squandered here in a minute. I got faith in you. And I got rickety wrecked. Rickety wrecked. Next time on Quarter Hour Gamers, we're still stuck on this damn level. <laughs> oh my god. We're doing really well. Lies! <laughs>